As Donald Trump rages against the FBI search of Mar-a-Lago earlier this month, his wife, Melania Trump, is doing what she often does, staying quiet. Those who spoke to CNN say privately Melania Trump was, quote, annoyed by federal agents searching her home, her things displaced, her closets of designer clothes upended. Her husband posting, just learned that agents went through the first lady's closets and rummaged through her clothing and personal items, surprisingly left the area in a relative mess. The ever private former first lady lives predominantly full time at Mar-a-Lago. She has retreated out of the public eye since leaving Washington. One of the most recent sightings of her was last month departing the funeral service for Ivana Trump in Manhattan, but little else. In July, she released a public statement confirming CNN reporting she wasn't paying attention to the raid on the Capitol on January 6th, instead overseeing a photo shoot of a rug inside the White House. On January 6, 2021, I was fulfilling one of my duties as First Lady of the United States of America, and accordingly, I was unaware what was simultaneously transpiring at the U.S. Capitol building. Her only media interview post White House this May, before and, the FBI um, search. You know, time flies fast, and uh, we are just, everybody's doing very well. Those who know her tell CNN there would be nothing of Donald Trump's in Melania Trump's living quarters. Not only do the couple have separate bedrooms, one person says Melania would, quote, never allow the former president to store his items in her space. Her interests of late? Melania Trump has apparently become an entrepreneur in the NFT cryptocurrency retail business, promoting a little-known website selling digital collectibles with America-related themes and moments from the Trump administration featuring her picture. It's the hawking of memorabilia by a former first lady for profit. There is no charitable component to the website she has promoted to her millions of Twitter followers. That has raised eyebrows. I have been working on my NFT projects uh, since I left the White House. My NFTs, they are available on MelaniaTrump.com and USMemorabilia.com. One former Trump advisor going so far as to say, quote, it's weird. It is unusual for a first lady to spend her post-White House popularity and platform on an endeavor in a narrow niche and not a global initiative. CNN has reached out several times for clarity on whether funds have gone to any specific children's charities and has never received a response. Well, people I see always criticize me whatever I do and I'm used to that. I move forward. So, Kate, I mean, this NFT venture in your report uh, is, it looks like, as you reported, a for-profit business. Do we know what the motive is for starting it? So I spoke to several people who, who talked to Melania Trump, and certainly they say that there is concern and worry, obviously, not knowing what the future is going to bring with the legal issues involving Donald Trump. But I will say former first ladies only get a $20,000 a year pension after their husbands die. Um, it's a sort of a paltry sum if you think about it, considering what a president gets to build his own office. So, you know, Melania Trump has always been smart about looking down the road, and perhaps that's what she's doing. Kate Bennett, thanks for the reporting tonight.